Hey guys, we just arrived to Istanbul. It's a very, very beautiful airport. I haven't been here before. This is so cool. It's a very big airport. Look. So we are going through the passport control and immigration. And see you later. This airport is very, very beautiful. I like those ceilings. Okay guys, once you got out, there are a lot of exchanges here, but I don't recommend you exchange your money here because the rates are higher. So, but if you need for taxi, just get like $50 and you can negotiate with them. So I was going to exchange $50 and they gave me 14.4 rate, but then I said no. And then all of a sudden they changed it to 17. So be careful so they don't rip you off. Just get as much as you need for taxi and, and that's it. And go out and in the city, you get a lot better rate. Okay guys, because we had a lot of stuff. We had to get a minivan and it was actually not bad at all. You should negotiate a little bit. First they told, told us 650 Turkish lira, but we negotiated down to 550. And it was kind of far. Actually, it was not bad at all, the price they offer. Yeah. Uh, if you have um, if you don't have that many luggages, you can easily go with a small taxi, some small cars, and those are like 300, 350. It's not bad at all. Look how this guy parked here. That's so funny. All right, guys, I found this very nice, cozy cafe. Supposedly the breakfast is amazing. It's called Dogasiyiz. So we came here to eat breakfast. So, so very famous Turkish cafe. So we were lucky that we they just connected these two tables together, so we can stay. We can sit outside. I found this place on TripAdvisor. What's Look. the name? Uh, Look, guys. Oh my God, I love fig. Look at those figs, so big. I'm just waiting to wash it and eat it. So we were waiting for Turkish cafe, five uh, Turkish uh, breakfast for five for five people. Oh my God, I'm so down, so ready. Oh my god, oh my god, look at that bread. So fresh. Omelette. Sujuk. Sujuk. It's a, it's a sausage, the Turkish sausage. Watermelon. Oh my god, tomato and cucumber. Olive. This is... Uh, this is cheese, this is hummus, a lot of stuff. Oh my god. Oh my god, so good. I don't know what my mom is saying. Ah, kaymak. Kaymak? Yes. Ah. Oh, gosh. Oh my god, we're gonna try. We're gonna try this. We don't have enough. Even though there's a table. Yeah, they keep bringing stuff. <laughs> this is so good. Belen, what are you doing? Turkish coffee, Turkish <laughs> breakfast, huh? Oh my god, look at that. Okay, we are done with the breakfast. This was absolutely phenomenal. It was so good. I highly recommend it. 
toca si es All right guys, here we are in Dolmabahçe Palace or Dolmabahçe However you want to pronounce it, it's very beautiful um, The ticket is 300 Turkish Lira You can buy it there And let's go see inside I'm not sure if I can record any video but if they let us, I will. So beautiful. It's just by the by the sea. So beautiful. Okay. This is so beautiful. Mm. 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 So beautiful. Let's go inside, it's so hot here. So here you pick your tray. Okay, in in a man Okay, you want to try different things. If you okay, I choose for you. Sure, yeah, yeah, go for it. And you can choose yeah, yeah, yeah. What you are. I think choose this. Sure. Are you okay with that? Okay. Let's move to find you. I feel the picnic on your food. I'm not scared. 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 بعد یه چیزی هستش اینجا اون خیلی واجبه واجبه خب واجبه رو بگیم اون واجبه داره این چی اینا اینا خوبه اینا واسه سیاه خوبه باش بگیم دیگه من نمیدونم هر چوی خودش فکر کنیم اینا ترای کنیم دیگه لحظه کن خوشتمون اومد میاییم دوباره میگیریم دیگه ببین چیز منی ها 
Guys, you have to get this. They put the they put the cream inside the baklava. It's so amazing. Oh my god. Okay, we got a lot of stuff. This is the chocolate one. This is the one that I showed you. They put uh, the cream in there. And these are uh, different types. Okay, so let me try this one. Let's go over the chocolate. And you have to do it upside down. Oh my god. So delicious. Chocolate. What does it taste like? It tastes like chocolate. So good. With honey? Yeah. You try it. Yeah. Good. Yeah. And our friend got tea. You have to get tea or Turkish coffee. It's so good. We try Turkish coffee in Mr. Egyptian. Oh, okay. So beautiful. <laughs> We're going to uh, Aya Sophia Mas. Hopefully, it's open. So beautiful. Okay guys, the next stop is this kofta. My Turkish friend brought us here. It's very... Ahmed... What? Sultan Ahmed. Sultan Ahmed Kofta Chise. It's very famous, very old. And it's right next to the Hagia Sophia uh, Mosque. So we are going to go try it. Kofta is very popular dish here. It's like, uh, it's meat. Um, ground meat with onion and stuff it's so delicious uh, i'll i'll take video add kofta okay we got this is this is kofta it's so delicious it's very moist i think it's lamb and beef together lamb or beef or both together lamb or beef Lamb, uh, it's a, it's lamb. I think it's all lamb. No, nah, no, nah, beef. It's beef. <laughs> okay, beef. It's beef. Awesome. Ah, bah, 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 bah. Okay, perfect. Let's try it. Belen, try it. Try it and let me know how. Try it with this. With that sauce. Mira. How is it? It's like kebab, right? Very good. <laughs> it's a mini kebab. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is Ayo Sophia Mosque. So beautiful. And it's open 24 7 because it's mosque. So big.
In the past, there, there was not electricity, you know. Okay. And uh, from the smoke of these lights, they used for pencils. They collapsed, uh, collected all of it in the rooms there, and on the walls, uh, mm -hmm. it it has been, uh, you know, uh, changed to coal, uh -huh. you know, coal, and they have used it for writing for uh -huh. pencils. بگو یه بار دیگه من عشقم من اترا هیلی عشقتم منم عشقتم Hey guys, today is our what third or fourth? Fourth, fourth I guess. <laughs> yeah, we have no third day, but we should whatever. So we this today we got tour. So the other days we wanted to visit some areas by, by ourselves, but I think it was very hard to manage time and it was not worth it. Yeah, we didn't see it quite a lot. So today we decided to get the tour and so far so good they picked us up from from our hotel at 8 30 and then with minivan and then they took us somewhere else and we got in a little bus and it's pretty good with ac everything is great yeah and the price was affordable i think we got it for like 55 dollars per person which, uh, which is like a one day tour they they take you yeah one whole day they take you from 8 30 a.m and they bring you back by like 8 p.m or 9 p.m so i put the i put the um, information of this tour in the description below so you want to check it out so let's be let's uh, go together <laughs> and uh, we can see it but I'll show you the second one as well, okay? Now uh, we will cross over the first bridge of Istanbul to go Asian side. <coughs> and the Ortega means middle village because it's in the middle of the strait. And during the Ottoman period, this part of Istanbul was just small fishing village, but today it's famous for luxury 
bars, nightclubs, go to restaurants, you can find here. And this mosque is from 19th century as well, from 1879. And the uh, architect is Balian, Okay, this is our first stop. This is the tallest and biggest flag in the whole Istanbul. Um, so we're gonna eat somewhere here, grab some breakfast. <coughs> yeah. And then next, we're gonna go to the biggest uh, mosque in the in the Istanbul. This place is so beautiful for taking picture and enjoy nice weather. Very beautiful. And there are little cafe here. You can buy stuff, you can buy food. All right, this is our second stop. This is the biggest mosque in the entire Turkey and Istanbul. It has capacity of 63,000 people praying at the same time. They also spent $75 million to make it. It's pretty new mosque. They finished it in 2019. It's very, very big. Very interesting. Wow, so, so big. So big, so interesting. So big. چقدر بزرگه خب دیگه مبادی که این موقع در دست آره دارم معلومه این چیز چیزی نیست چیزی نیست نه ولی بازم هم همینه هم. 19 خب alright so beautiful I like this area English Thank you. Okay, they give you this little, it's like phone, and it translates for you and explain what's going on. And this is Belen, my love. <laughs> They're having fun together, like always. Yes. <laughs> it's a beautiful, it's a beautiful day to be so beautiful and this very big bridge I don't know the name of it but so beautiful all right here is the 
museum, I guess. And they told us they don't let uh, let us film or take picture here. Unfortunately, I cannot I cannot take video. But I would I would get as much as I can. So beautiful, look, it's just by the sea. Excuse me, is this the Black Sea? No. Which sea is this? It's Bosor. Bosor. Oh, this is Mar Marmara? It's between Black Sea and Marmara ah. Sea. It's just Bosphorus. Oh, okay. Okay. Bosphorus. Interesting. So, this area is Bosphorus, right? It's between, uh, it's between uh, Black Sea and Marmara Sea. So, so beautiful. Okay guys, this is our fourth stop. Um, we got here, we gonna, we gotta get in the, the cable car. And I'm gonna get some of, this, some of these potatoes. Looks so good. So. So it's hot and then I ordered uh, this special bread with cheese so cool they make it right here yeah this place is so beautiful a very good cafe over there we got into a cable car. It's so cool. So beautiful. It's hot as hell here. It rained and stopped. It's a lot more humid. Okay, the next stop is lunch. So it's so good. Everything is organized already. They already have the table ready for us. Everything. This place is also very good. It look very good. They have everything. Seven up. So. Seven up. It's right. Berlin. Are you enjoying? Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. This is our last stop. We are going boating for like three hours, I guess. Huh? In the boat first. Yeah, Belen is here enjoying. So it's around 4 p.m., 4.30. You're gonna be here in the boat until 8. So it's gonna be a lot of fun.
à gauche du bâton, on voit le grand bâtiment, le bâtiment rouge, c'est l'école de Fenel, c'est la première école avec qui a été construite par le sultan Mohammed le deuxième en 1454. Mais maintenant l'école comprend trois sections, musée, église et école. Si vous êtes dans le musée, il faut prendre le mois 99 de station Emnono. For me? Thank you.